Hello and welcome. My name is Purya Saidu and I'm from Cosmo Intel, founded by Muhammad Ali Tahari. And today I will be presenting a few studies investigating the effect of Tahari consciousness field on some biological and biomimetic systems. Natural enzymes are ubiquitous biocatalysts with high substrate specificity that have attracted enormous attention because of their potential applications and utilization in pharmaceutical processes, agrochemical productions, and more. Natural enzymes accelerate the rate of chemical reactions up to 1019 times for specific substrates. However, these enzymes have several intrinsic drawbacks, which limit their utilization in practical applications. The study of chemical structure with biomolecular activity that mimic the behavior of biological molecules have always been of interest for researchers in the field of early life, as well as in technology and industry. Among these compounds, a type of nanomaterial with enzyme-like activity, called nanozymes, has comparable performance with endogenous cellular compounds and has great potentials to replace natural enzymes. Moreover, supermolecular biomimicry models are aggregates of chemical components that have the ability to mimic the function of biological molecules. Through these studies, we are investigating the possible effect of Tahari consciousness field, TCFs, on the structure and function of HRP enzymes and two self-assembled structures with enzyme-like behavior. In a novel approach presented by Muhammad Ali Tahari, consciousness is one of the three elements of the universe that is neither matter nor energy, but that has direct effect on both matter and energy through a specific and distinct non-material, non-energetic fields called the consciousness field, TF which are the subcategories of a richly networked universal internet fields called the Cosmic Consciousness Network. In Science Fact is founded by Muhammad Ali Tahari to utilize the facilities of conventional science to prove the potential effect on matter and energy. By defining consciousness as neither matter nor energy, we cannot associate a quantity to it. Since consciousness is immeasurable, its existing can only be known through experience. Although the mechanism of this linkage is not yet definable by science, its consequences can be measured and studied scientifically. Science fact discovers evidence of influence on the world of matter and energy through the consciousness fields, but conventional science studies matter and energy. In science fact, the world of science is seen as a tool for the emergence of science fact evidence. The Tahari consciousness fields are initiated by an announcer that connects the object to the hypothetical cosmic internet for specific purposes. According to Tahari, the Cosmic Consciousness Network, CCN, contains all of the data and structural and functional information of all the constituents of the universe, and is capable of modifying the behavior of all components and particles that are placed in connection with this consciousness field. In Faradamani TCF1 intervention, upon the initiation of the announcement by the announcer, a connection is formed between each component of the system under the study, the partial consciousness, and the cosmic consciousness network, the whole consciousness. Faradamani and other consciousness fields are mediated by the human mind as an announcer. In science fact, the study of phases of TCFs are subcategorized in five stages. The current study is in the zero phase, aiming to prove the existence of TCFs by observing their effect. Materials and methods. Given the important role of hydrogen peroxide in the early atmosphere and the evolution of life, we chose H2O2 in our research. Four stratage peroxide, gold nanozyme, and micellar tested in a temetine. The UV vis spectra were used. And finally, the kinetic assay. In this study, the effect of the FCF is a study on the structure and function of HRP in both pure laboratory and plant extract. The results of the FCF treatment suggest a confirmation of the effect of a material and non-energetic field on the structure and function of HRP in the same physical conditions in the samples that received the FCF compared to the untreated control. Increasing the amount of Km in the environment with increasing concentration of the substrate in a kinetic assay situation have created a characteristic reduction in enzymatic behavior such that it prepares the enzyme to accept more diverse substrates. On the other hand, the increased KCAT in the extracted enzyme under the FCF treatment during both extraction and kinetic assay shows a significant accordance with HRP general function. 
it is noteworthy that the decrease of 4% in KM in the treatment mode during extraction and changes in the value of functional properties of the same enzyme treated during the experiment suggest reproducibility of behavior under ferrodimony consciousness field. In both samples, there was a notable effect of the enzyme kinetics when FCF was applied during the assay. These results indicate that the application of a FCF to HRP creates a measurable change to the performance of the enzyme, substantiating the presence of the Faradamoni consciousness field. These demonstrations of the FCF effects on HRP by the remarkable changes in HRP kinetics suggest its existence that requires further studies in other fields of biological, chemical, and physical sciences. Additional studies on the influence of the Faradamoni consciousness field on other types of viral enzymes and proteins are being pursued by the authors of this study. Investigating the biologic-like behaviors of chemical systems is an important and major step in understanding the origin of life. Considering the theory of CFs, the probable influence of CFs on changing the biologic-like behaviors of chemical molecules is of great importance and helps shed light on understanding the mechanism of life and its formation. In the present study, we use the same enzymatic behavior assays as the catalyst of hydrogen peroxide. We used an enzyme-like molecules of gold nanoparticles. CFA treatment in this study was performed in two stages of preparation, nanoparticle synthesis, as well as during the measurement of kinetic activity. According to the results of this present study, the CFA treatment in the preparation stage leads to about 20% smaller but more homogeneous particle size of AU enzyme. These changes caused about 4% reduction in the H2O2 decomposition reaction rate in comparison with untreated controls. Interestingly, the application of CF during AU nanozyme operation also has the effect of changing the activity of the nanozyme, making it 4% more specific for its substrate in comparison with untreated control. In this test, CFA treatment during kinetic assay also compensates for the deceleration caused by the reduction in the size of the nanozymes during their operation. In this study, we observed two optimizations that occurs under the CFA treatment. One, formation of a more homogeneous size of the nanoparticles, and two, a reduction in the value of KM suggesting an increase in the substrate selection power. To summarize, this study indicates the effect of CFA on the biomimetic behavior of gold nanozymes by considering the parameters of particle size and homogeneity and substrate selectivity. We propose that it is imperative to further investigate other biomimetic models under the influence of CFs to better explain the behaviors of these chemical systems prior to life formation. One of the features that enable living cells and systems to reproduce early in life is hierarchical self-organization, and many molecules in chemistry and biology are known for this ability. Self-organization, the process by which components of collective behavior organize themselves to create global order through interactions between themselves. In the present study, we use STS surfactants as they have the ability to form spherical micelles similar to spherical enzymes and proteins. Moreover, placing hemithine as a prostatic group in coordination with testidine at the center of micellar structures provides a state and structure that most resembles natural enzymes and proteins such as catalase, proxidase, and hemoglobin in the laboratory. These models were constructed in two modes under treatments of CFA and without it. We then investigated the structural and functional properties of the constructed models in colloidal solutions during the catalysis of substrate. This study shows that CF treatments leads to homogeneity of particle size and enhances enzymatic catalysis performance in vitro. In the current study, we investigate the effect of the CFA on micellar supermolecular structures and report a lack of change in the chemical structure of synthesized models. In contrast, associations between changes in particle size distribution and general catalytic power can be seen in sample of the present study. Additionally, CF treatments resulted in a significant decrease in zeta potential 41%, increase in conductivity 45%, and mobility 42% of sample molecules compared to the untreated controls. This indicates a higher stability of the sample 
increase charged particles at the surface of biomimetic structures and consequently increase mobility in the colloidal environment, respectively increasing the mobility and the stability of biological structures such as protein and ribonucleic acids are factors that play a role in constitution of biological systems. We conclude that CFA plays a role in guiding the behavior of biomimetic models closer to the behavior of biological molecules. This suggests the possible function of these fields in the formation of life and may aid the existing theories for beginning of life events. Further studies using experimental simulations and other design models are suggested to investigate the influence of CFs on early life events. These results indicate PCF1 can cause reproducible and significant changes in the behavior of biologic and biomimetic molecules. The ability of PCF1 to affect biological and biomimetic systems merits further research to identify the extent and mechanism of action of the Tari consciousness field in the origin of life processes.